Well, hi there, Tim Crosby here, and um, today we're going to tackle one of my all-time favorite flat pick fiddle tunes, um, Salt Creek, sometimes called Salt River, and uh, it's, it's a very common fiddle tune. The uh, uh, bluegrass fiddlers play it all the time and bluegrass flat pickers. It was one of the kind of the foundational flat pick pieces on an early Doc Watson recording, which is where I learned it. Uh, what I'm going to walk you through today is a little fancier version. Uh, I figured that it's pretty easy to find a basic version of just... And so I thought I'd throw in some of uh, kind of Doc Watson style chromatic Things and let's get right to it. the The transcript is on the website here. You're uh, um, encouraged to download it, and I'll attempt to play it note for note the way I transcribed it. But there may be a few variations. But I got to tell you, that's one of the points of it. Once you start getting the hang of some of these these chromatic licks, even if you're not following it exactly the way it says on the paper you'll be able to find some interesting variations on your own. So here we go. I'll play it um, slowly because I, I play everything slowly these days. So. So a couple of things I wanted to point out to you. One is this um, in the B part of the tune. This little lick here. You have this interesting thing. You go up the neck and then you use that open string to get back down to this position. And then you use that same lick out of the F chord or G. a fancier version of Salt Creek. Um, oh, another thing about this lick, you're going to find other places to use it. Um, one elsewhere lurking on the website here is uh, a similar configuration in, in the tune Forky Deer. So mess around with that a lot. Anyway, Salt Creek or Salt River. You'll notice I'm capoed because fiddle players play it in A. Um, guitar players, if there's no fiddle player or mandolin player to put the nudge on you, you can play it out of an open G. And that's how I've got the transcript written. Um, yeah, thanks for being here. I'm Tim Crosby. Come and see me in person sometime if you want to find out more about this flat picking stuff or other things. But in the meantime, be well. <laughs>